Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this tutorial, we will learn about JList in Java NetBeans. So let's start. First, I will open NetBeans and I will create a new project. And I will click uh, Java application and then I will click next. Here I will give the application name as JList demo and now I'll click finish to create the project now here I have the project so I'll close this one as well as this one now I'll come here to the source package and now I will right click on this and click new new JFrame form and click finish to create it now I will extend it on both sides and now I will drag in a list now here you can see we have this list if I run this I will have these item 1 item 2 item 3 and item 4 and item 5 in it you can use a list in, instead of uh, radio buttons because you can select one of the multiple values from a list you can also use it uh, instead of check boxes because it uh, also uh, allow multiple selections now I will change this item from the uh, designer so I will click on this here we have the properties so I will search for this model and I will click on this I will remove this and I can enter CR7 Messi Ne Ma and M B P and if I click OK and now run this you can see that all these four names are now on your screen <coughs> now if these names are more than this uh, the size of this uh, list uh, it can uh, it will uh, create a scr scroll bar automatically and you can scroll through it uh, now I will get a button here on this form I will name it as get player name and now uh, I will double click on it to create its uh, click event and now here I will write some code Jobption pen dot show message dialog and here I will use J list and if I control space it control space it it will uh, and the name of the J list will appear now J list dot get selected value and now if I run this and if I select on this and if I click this get player name so you can see CR7 is uh, shown and if I click on this uh, now you can see MBAP is shown so in this way you can add values and get values from uh, a list in Java now I will go to the design and remove all these names uh, I will click on this uh, list box and I come I will come to this model not this one but this one okay let me close this and this one I will remove all the names click OK and now I will go to code and here I will add names to this list box programmatically now I will create 
a string array of names is equal to semicolon and here I will add uh, CR7 comma now it uh, because these are strings so we will use double quotes CR7 let me make this capital Messi Beckham and Mbappe now how can I add these to this uh, J list so I'll use J list one dot set set model new default list model and now here I will pass names array now it is showing an error let me check this error because we have used a, a here default list model instead of this we have to use uh, default combo box model and now here I will for pass names and now if I run this And if I click on CR7 and get player name, CR7 is uh, shown. And if I click on this, uh, this is shown. And if I click on this, Mbappe will be shown. Now, let me show you. Let me increase these names inside this uh, list. And we can show, we will see that if a scroll bar appears or not now if I run this again now I have to copy paste it uh, one time more now copy these control C and now toward the end I will paste it and now if I run this now you can see that the scroll bar appears automatically if the names in the list are greater than the length of this the height of this um, list box so i hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment on my videos thank you